mean, I think they're close enough that a like individual size variation would have played the most decisive role. If one of them was clearly bigger, it would probably have the best chance of winning. But assuming sizes are roughly equal, uh, yeah, I mean, you can always come back to T-Rex has the stronger bite, and that, you know, probably gives it a bit of an upper hand if it lands a good bite. Um, but, you know, a really big Allosaurus, like, Chickenotosaurus is still going to have a pretty darn good bite, too. Yeah, I mean, I'd say it's probably close to a coin flip if you're talking about random individuals, uh, again, because of the size thing. Um, but, sure, everything being equal, probably slightly more often than not, it'd be the T-Rex just because of having a bigger or a stronger bite.